remembered there was a patio upstairs. But the only thing I'd managed to clock in that place was the smoking area. Some guys took Giovanni and Fabiano. What? Jesus, Max, hey, I'm on my way. No, 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 stay in the chopper. We'll need a way out of here. I'll go find Got the girls. Got him. Got him. They came out there. They went that way into the lounge. Come go, go. Get up, get up. I can't stay here. I need you to lock this door behind me. Get everybody else out of here. Oh. Son of a bitch. Just outside of Bismarck. Anders Stetlin. This is some place, huh? They, they told me it was a little fresh, but I wasn't expecting things to be quite like this. No? No, see, I've, I've seen things. I was a cop for 25 years. I've seen men run over by combines. I've seen husbands who just ate their wives, but a gunfight in a disco? You were a cop? Yeah, just retired. Oh, what a life that was. And it gave me the money to raise a family. Well, I've got a girl at college in Wisconsin and a boy who's playing football for Minnesota State. You want to see their picture? No, no, that's all right. Oh. Sounds nice. Listen, you stay in here. Don't be a hero. Oh, I won't. I'm retired. Happy, healthy ex-cop. Give me a break. It looked loud and expensive enough to be Fabiana's. Her fashion sense didn't leave a whole lot of room for imagination, let alone food. The girl sure knew how to draw the eye, and maybe that was the problem. But at least I was heading in the right direction. Chega! Que porra você tá fazendo? Como assim? Você tá com algum problema, cara? Whatever the hell they were arguing about, it was time for me to add my two cents. <laughs>
choice but to keep pushing forward. Victor's political campaign was starting to come unstuck. Seemed the Broncos' luck was on the turn. If only that was the worst news they'd received that day. starting to look a lot like friends of the gate crashers at last week's party. These guys had some real issues with the Broncos. 